G'day, it's ET here from the Escape Fishing with ET show. Our target species today is the King George Whiting, and I've got two great Shimano combos to get you underway. I love catching King George Whiting. They're one of my favourite southern species and beautiful to eat as well. And these two rods, well, let's take a look. This one here is the Shimano Solstice XT, a beautiful light rod for whiting fishing with a super sensitive tip. You won't miss any bites there. A powerful butt matched up with this lovely Sienna 2500 Shimano reel. A perfect little outfit for whiting fishing. The other great rod is this beautiful Sedona XT. Extra long, super sensitive tip. And this tip actually comes out and can be replaced with this fluoro yellow. Perfect for low light fishing and a really good rod matched up with this beautiful Sedona 2500 reel. We'll pack loads of line on there. Be able to get nice long casts out and you will not miss a bite with this nibble tip. Absolutely brilliant. Two great combos to catch your King George Whiting. There are so many quality braid brands here at Anaconda, but my favourite is the Kairiki Shimano in six pounds. That'll work a treat and you need some of this Oshia leader, four pound Oshia fluorocarbon to catch that trophy whiting. Black Magic, Snatcher and Whacker rigs are always worth having in your tackle box, as well as some of these shore catch pre-tied rigs. They'll make it easy when you're out on the water. Bait fishing with pippy, squid and mussels at top notch. Throw in a burly cage and some pellets and you're halfway there. With all that burly going into the water, a nice Pat Noster rig seems to do the trick. Usually a ball sinker down on the bottom, a couple of Black Magic KL10s will allow you to catch that big one. Put in a three-way rod rack, carry a life jacket and throw in all your tools like scissors, lip grips, filleting knife, pliers and a bait knife. And all you need is to throw in the net to land that trophy whiting. Here we go. Nice one. Oh, beautiful. Great eating too. 